Yo, 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 what's good, YouTube? Uh, today, I decided to do a video on how to get the ARM for Battlefield Hardline. I ain't gonna go through it all. I'm just gonna let you know probably like the last part of it. You know what I mean? Um, some of the pre-stuff that you gotta do, you gotta have the operator as, uh, assessment too. And uh, you gotta have, you have to buy 10 operator gadgets. You know what I mean? So that's like, you know what I mean? Uh, all the, the guns, the some of the, um, let me see, all the, the guns, some of the equipment and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Like the stunt driver and the revive. You know what I mean? You have to get stuff like that too. Um, after you do that, you have to also get, you have to also unlock the operator gold star, server star. So basically, if you play with the operator, uh, you basically already go unlock that stuff. You know what I mean? Because you already know that you need extra stuff. So you already going to be buying it anyway. So you probably already do the pre stuff. Now, the actual, after the pre, you have to do this, which is basically kind of irritating. You have to get 200 assault rifle kills. Now, that's after the pre. So even if you already getting assault kills, you know what I mean? You're going to have to start all the way over and get 200 more, which is, like I said, it's not a lot if you're an operator. You play as operator all the time anyways. And then after that, you have to get um, uh, 15 first aid pack coins. So basically, like I said, if you're operator, uh, you basically get the med pack. Just throw that shit down all the time. Every time you see somebody with low health, matter of fact, don't even worry about if you see somebody with low health. Just throw it down anyways. Fuck it. You know what I mean? Just throw it down anyways. Just boom, throw it down. Anyway, they're going to be getting on. No, next thing you know, you're going to be getting that. That shit comes easy. Next, I say one of the uh, close to the most difficult one will be the revive coins. And basically how you get that is with, okay, if, you, if you're if you the thief, if you're the bad guys, you have like the little, you know what I mean, uh, drilling and rush, drilling, you know what I mean? You have that, so you, you hit them with that, and it brings them back. And if you the the cops, you got the defibrators, you know what I mean? You got that shit. I don't know if I even said that right, but you got that, you know what I mean? So you get them back up with that. Basically, um, you need to do that five times in a match. So every every five times you do that, you get a revive coin. So one, two, three, four, five, re, uh, revive coin. One, two, three, four, five, revive coin. You, def, you have to do that 15 times, you know what I mean? So basically, you know what I mean? That's 15, shit, I mean, uh, five times 15 you know what i mean you do the math and uh let me see okay the most difficult one is the tier reputation now how you get that is basically like if you you have you can't die so let's say you go you're you're killing people you're doing your thing boom 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 they basically reward you by giving you uh uh uh, uh tier rep that, that basically rewards you giving you tier reputation and shit like that you know what i mean like extra magazine or reload your clip faster and you know what i mean stuff like that and uh so basically to me the easiest way to do this is to basically play hot wire you know what i mean i say that because basically not just hot wire they don't just go to a match where you know what i mean it's 32 people Try to find a match that has maybe five people. So basically, you ain't got to worry about them blowing your car up. Because basically what I do and how I've done it, you know what I mean, is basically you find a match with a lot of the least people in it. And what, like, you know what I mean, five or six people. And basically, they're not worried about really killing you. They're worried about trying to do the same thing you're doing. So basically, you can run around and run around. And basically, oh, oh another thing. put uh, Go to your boost and put the highest reputation boost that you got. You know what I mean? Like, if you got a 200 percentage one definitely that one would that one will definitely get you right quick uh yeah do that so basically like i said get in the car and just keep going around boom with the reputation boost on next to you know you'll keep you'll get all the way up to uh, 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 you'll get all the way up to tier four now the thing is is once you get to tier four this is really if you want the points if you want to complete the match, you can go ahead and complete the match. But in reality, once it says, "Oh, you're a feared, uh, feared operator," you know what I mean. You can already, you can go ahead and quit that match because you've already gotten, you know what I mean, that that one thing that you need for the what's called. You have to do that ten times. So, and it's ten ten times in ten different matches. So once you do that, you can get out of that. Go to another match. Get out of that. And once you have that, shit, you get the you get a gold battle pack and you get the ARM. So, like I said, man. Uh, I'll be doing more videos letting you guys know uh, <clears throat> different ways and how to get stuff easier and stuff like that. Uh, you can follow me on Xbox One, Xbox Live, whatever. Uh, Guns and Gloria. I'll leave a 
leave my name and description at the bottom. Uh, peace.